You'd expect topics discussed behind closed doors to stay private, right? Well, if you have hardware produced by Owl Labs in the room, think again as many of the developer's conference room cameras have been found to collect and expose sensitive data online. We'll give you the rundown on a list of vulnerabilities and what Owl owners can do right now to prevent them as we sit down and sync up with Rocket IT's weekly technology update. Hello everyone, I'm Chris Swinson, Technology Insider here at Rocket IT, and welcome to Sync Up, your new home for Trinity Technology News. If you're familiar with smart speakers like the Amazon Echo, the Google Nest, or the Apple HomePod, picture the Owl Pro as a similar piece of technology, but without the smart home functionality. Instead, the Owl line of devices are business solutions meant to capture video and audio for virtual conference calls. To accomplish this, Owl devices have multiple cameras and microphones adhered to the top, allowing them to capture 360 degree video and audio of the room that they're placed within. Knowing that these devices are likely recording and broadcasting some pretty high profile executive meetings, you'd expect it to have some tightly secured software, right? Well, unfortunately, it's been proved that this is far from the case. In a recent article published by ARS Technica, it's noted that our devices pose a massive risk to connecting networks and their administrators. Specifically, the report notes that names, email addresses, and IP addresses of OWL owners are stored in an easily accessible database online. All that's needed to access this information is the serial number of the OWL device in question. In turn, hackers could potentially use this data to conduct spear phishing attacks against high-value individuals such as CEOs and individuals over payroll. Alongside the exposed personal information of admins, images from meeting sessions were also found to be easily accessible in a similar database online. Specifically, OWL devices have what's called a whiteboard feature, which automatically captures and displays what's written on whiteboards during meetings. Needless to say, if you're having a private meeting to discuss business, it's likely you don't want that information exposed online for all to see. But the vulnerabilities don't stop there. In addition to unsecured databases, OWL devices themselves pose a risk. For example, the Bluetooth functionality of these devices require no password by default. In turn, it'd be extremely easy for a hacker within Bluetooth range to control the device. Taking things a step further, if a Bluetooth vulnerability is found, hackers could potentially use the OWL as a tool to spread malware on the business network. So, what did OWL Labs have to say about all of this? In a statement collected by ARS Technica, an OWL Labs spokesperson said, OWL Labs takes these vulnerabilities seriously. To the best of our knowledge, there have never been any customer security breaches. We have either already addressed or are in the process of addressing other points raised in the research report. Now, seeing as OWL devices are used by more than 100,000 businesses across the globe, what should you do if you're using one? Simply put, completely turn off the device until at least the Bluetooth vulnerabilities are resolved. In the meantime, look for another option when it comes to video conferencing technologies. For example, while the OWL line is unique in that it provides a 360 degree view of the room it's placed within, brands like Logitech, Jabra, and Candeo offer hardware with similar functionality. That said, before you launch any recording device on your network, it's crucial to have cybersecurity tools in place to notify you if a piece of hardware becomes compromised. To learn how Rocket IT's cybersecurity service helps businesses remain proactive against these threats, contact us using the link in this video's description. And to stay up to date on Trinity Technology news, hit that subscribe button and the bell to catch us on next week's episode of Sync Up with Rocket IT.